Hello and welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Megan. I am a mid-sized fashion blogger and a lifestyle blogger. I kind of share a little bit of everything. So if that is something that you are interested in, please make sure to like and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Today's video is actually a really exciting one because I am doing a Shein try-on haul. Um, everything that I did get is a little bit more geared towards spring, which I know is a little crazy right now because it is in the negatives and has been in the negatives all week here and we have piles of snow. But I am hoping that by trying on more spring things, maybe spring will just automatically come. Here's my hope for that. Um, but what's really kind of exciting and really interesting about today's try-on is I personally have not ordered from Shein in almost four years. I had a really bad experience when it came to sizing and figuring out what my size was, and I kind of just wrote the brand off, not gonna lie. Um, but I have just been seeing the last couple of months so many gorgeous, curvy, and mid-sized girls sharing their Shein try-ons, telling me, you know, I should give them one more shot. So that is basically what this video is. I'm giving them one more shot and seeing how their clothes fit, how they are, and what my actual overall thoughts are. So if you are interested, keep watching. All right, first up we have is this gorgeous floral dress. I love this one. I think that this is my favorite. I got it in a 2XL, but I definitely feel like I could have got a 1XL because the top part of it is very stretchy. Um, it kind of reminds me of the 90s, which if you don't know already, the 90s are back. Um, but those really stretchy tops that we used to wear back in the day, that is what the top part of this material is. Um, very stretchy, very flattering, and then it just flows out. Out, um, and it gives you like a lot of like twirling um, at the bottom which I really love the neckline is a square neckline and then the uh, sleeves are like a mid-length mid-length sleeve uh, with like a stretchy elastic band so you actually could kind of adjust the sleeve um, and move that up if you wanted to make it more of a shorter sleeve or leave it longer and have it be a mid-length sleeve but overall I really like this dress I was really impressed the material is kind of like a softer material and it's very lightweight um, but it's not see-through whatsoever I love the print of it I think it's so pretty um, with the purple the purple gives me kind of like that pastel-y purple color which is very popular um, and it kind of also gives me like a girly but grungy vibe which um, I kind of love that style and think that it's really cute for all right, this next item that I'm gonna be sharing with you is kind of more of a trendier item, and I also feel like it's not for everybody, not in the sense that they can't wear it, just in the sense that this might not be your style. And I saw a lot of it last year in the spring and the summer, and that is leather shorts. These were so popular last year. Um, I didn't try them last year, and I wanted to give them a try this year because I've been seeing them um, around a lot more, and I figured, especially with the trendy more I Item. I figure how about I try it more and get it when it's more cheaper um, and less expensive because if it is something that I don't like then I don't feel so bad that I just spend that money on these shorts so these are the leather shorts that I got um, it does have pockets in the front they're kind of like a square pocket and the band is so stretchy the back there is no pockets um, they're very big pants they're very long like they're high-waisted they're meant to be worn high-waisted um, and they're meant to be kind of a long like baggier kind of style um, so if that's something that is not interested you're not interested in then these might not be the shorts for you but overall I did really like them I liked how they fit on me and I'm actually really excited to kind of style them in the spring and the summer all right, and then next up is this gorgeous blue dress. Um, I did get it in a 2XL. Um, it does look like it's a denim dress, but it is definitely not denim material. It is so gorgeous. I also love how you can either wear it where the shoulders are up, or you can wear it where the shoulders are down and kind of make it like a strapless number. Um, this dress does get wrinkly very easily, so you are gonna have to like steam it before you wear it. Um, and it has this really pretty like, uh, tie in the front the tie is not adjustable it is just there for detail um, but then it kind of like looks like it's cinched in which I think is really pretty um, the back part of it it is a zip up um, the zipper it's not the greatest zipper like it works and it does go up but there were a couple of times that it did get stuck um, but again 
you get what you pay for. Uh, but overall, I do think that this dress is really pretty. I love this for spring. I think this will be gorgeous on anybody. Um, and overall, I just had so much fun in it. I kind of like felt like a little princess. And it, this is one of those dresses that you can definitely either dress up or dress down and rock it, wear it all spring and all summer. All right, the next item that I have for you is also another trendier item that I have been seeing and I've really been loving. I just actually haven't bought it yet, and that is a shacket. Um, I have been seeing this all over the place, especially on Instagram, um, more in the fall, winter time. I don't know if I could wear this right now with how cold it is outside. Um, this, the material of this one, it's more of a shirt in that more of the jacket part um, but I would definitely be wearing this and I can see myself wearing this um, in the spring and um, like summer nights I think this would be a good thing to grab um, I did get it in the neutral color because I feel like this just goes with my style a little bit more um, I love the button details um, you get it going down and then you also get it um, on the sleeve as well so then you can roll up the sleeve or you can just um, button it and have it be more of a fit look um, both sides um, on the chest you do get a back packet which you can put stuff in it is an actual packet which I really did like and it's very long and oversized um, I did get this is the only thing that I got an XL in um, they actually didn't have any cute like on the curvier side they didn't really have any cute shackets over there um, but shackets are meant to be oversized and they're produced and made oversized so I felt that going with an XL um, in the regular size would work and it really did um, I liked how long it was in the back um, overall I did really like it uh, when it though comes to how it's gonna keep you warm because it's a shacket I don't know about that. <laughs> you are definitely gonna have to wear a lot of layers, especially if you do get this one, um, because the material of it is very thin. Um, so I don't know if I, again, I've never had a shacket, so I can't compare, um, but this is a thin material. And if anything, it's just a layering piece. But overall, I do really like this one, and I think that it's really cute. All right, now this next top is definitely like a going out top, and this top is gorgeous. Now, mind you, I did buy this tops in hope um, that come my birthday, which is August, um, things will be open up a little bit more. Now that we have the vaccine, I have a lot more hope um, that things potentially, I don't think it's gonna go 100% back to normal, but I do think that we're gonna have a little bit more opening, a little bit more flexibility with things, um, and that's kind of than why I got this top um, because my birthday is this year I'm turning 30 Ooh, yes I know um, but it's my golden birthday and to be honest I want to look good every single day the whole month of August like that is my plan and my goal and this is the top one of probably the many tops that is gonna do that for me um, I love it um, I love a sheer sleeve um, this is very adjustable same with the end this is very adjustable too um, it does zip in the back this zipper is more of a heavy duty zipper um, more heavy duty than the last dress that I tried on that had a zipper um, the one thing that I do want to point out for you guys so so in this detail right here you can see it kind of looks like a glitter material I don't know if that's picking it up and you can see it um, it is not glitter it feels more like velcro um, and then it looks like the like woven in um, like a sheer material to make it look like it's glitter but it's really actually not glitter um, and it also goes down the side and it kind of gives you like that corset look overall I really love this my only complaint with this which mind you when I did purchase this I knew that if I wore this I would probably wear this with either high-waisted shorts pants or a high-waisted skirt it had to be worn with something high-waisted I always do that and intended on doing that um, but I wish that the um, it was just like an inch or two longer it does work um, and it fits me fine with anything high-waisted um, but I'm 5'8 so I don't know I just wish that there was like an inch more material at the bottom then I think that it would be perfect that is my only downside with this but overall love this top and I actually now can't wait to start celebrating my birthday which I celebrate all month 
Alright, next up I have this graphic tee. I just really love this graphic tee and for the price I thought that that was amazing. Um, it's an oversized graphic tee um, and I also love that it was a tie-dye material. Um, now the fabric itself, it's not like a cloth t-shirt. It's one of those like stretchy, um, breathable uh, materials um, and it kind of reads more like of a shinier look than like a t-shirt look. Uh, but overall I did like the length of it. Um, this would be something that I think that you can either tuck in and wear with anything or you could wear it really long with biker shorts. Um, overall I thought that this was really cute. I'm not really wild about how long the sleeves are. Um, this would definitely be something that I would probably cut up a little bit um, and for the price I don't feel Feel bad then for cutting up uh, but overall I did really like this and I just thought that this was I don't I feel like you could never have too many graphic tees personally so if anything this just added to my collection and I really liked this one so next up I have a top for you guys that even when I bought it, I kind of thought and knew that it might not work for me. Um, my whole intent of buying this top is one of my of many um, favorite like curvier bloggers, uh, Noelle. In the summertime, she had shared, I'll share a photo right here. She had shared herself um, kind of in a top like this and I just thought it was so beautiful on her. I loved how it kind of hugged her curves and I thought that, hey, I'm gonna try that out. Um, so then I bought this. <laughs> But unfortunately, this did not um, look as nicely as I thought it did. And I think why it didn't is because right here along the sides, I don't think that it, it came down far enough for my body type. Um, and I think it needed a little bit more fabric there. Um, but overall, I thought that the pattern of it was really pretty and I liked that um, it was like a zipper in the back. I just didn't, I think that the cut of this and especially with tops like this, it really is all about the cut. Um, the cut of it, I think just needed to be a little bit longer for me and it just didn't work. But I'm not giving up on trying to find a top like this that will work for my body. I think that there is one out there, clearly because I've seen so many gorgeous girls wear it last summer and last spring. Um, but this just wasn't the one for me. Um, so this is a no. All right, and then next up is this purple plaid skirt, and I really like this skirt. Um, the length of it was really good on me. Um, it came up high enough, but it also wasn't short enough. Um, it does have like two slits in the front on both sides, which I really like. Um, the two things, though, I will say about this is that the zipper, it is that like flimsy zipper, um, similar to the one dress that I shared with you, so that, um, I was kind of like a little disappointed about but again like you kind of get what you pay for but I did think that this zipper was still a little bit better than the um, dress that I tried on and then the second thing is this material it is a little bit more thinner than what I thought it was going to be now it's not thin where it is see-through it is just thin in the fact that me personally I would probably wear like tighter like cheerleader shorts or something underneath um, just because I would want to just be a little bit more protected in that aspect not that I think that this would fly up or anything like that um, only solely in the fact that the material is just really thin uh, but overall I really did like this I got a 2XL um, definitely gonna be keeping this one and definitely gonna be styling this so many different ways in the spring and the summer and then the last thing that I have for you guys is actually this loungewear set. Now, typically I don't really buy sets in loungewear. Like I, I will, but I don't like to buy them when you have to get like one size in both. Um, I like to get more loungewear sets where I can mix and match the sizes because that works best for me and that was kind of the case with this. Um, so I knew it was going to be a cropped top. Um, I didn't think it was going to be this cropped. I'm finding that anything cropped at Shein, um, especially after this order, because I am 5'8", their crop just doesn't hit me right so if anything the next time I do order I just need to be more conscious of that um, but overall the material is really soft I just wish that it was just a little bit longer as a cropped so the top um, was kind of a no for me am I still gonna wear it yes um, I just am gonna have to be cautious 
if we have guests over, which we don't really have that many guests over anyways because of the pandemic. Um, but the bottoms, these were a yes. Again, so soft, very stretchy. It does have a tie detail, but again, that's just detail. Um, I love these. I wore these last night and I think that they're so comfortable. So it was kind of a win, but it was kind of a not win for me on the sets. All right, and then that is it for today's haul. I hope that you guys really enjoyed that. I will have everything linked and my sizes in the description below. Thank you so much for watching. And if this is something that you enjoy, please make sure to like and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Have a great day.